I don't think this audience or these drinkers are coming back, period. I think they're gone, depleted. And I think it will have continuous ripple effects throughout the rest of the company and across all of their other brands. I don't think that can be undone. I mean, there's certain things that people can't unsee. You know what I'm talking about. Even when you try and play commercials like this one. So I'm not playing it at full volume because there's some music there and there's all kinds of rules about the music you can play and not play, blah, blah, blah. But if you look at this commercial, I'm showing it to you right here. What do they keep focusing on? Sort of everyday folks, right? Because that is, that's who drinks them. And go into a football game. Because football is America, football is every day, football is supposed to be Bud Light, barbecues, you see, you see, you see. Young guys, football team, you know, down at Georgia Southern, they put the entire football team's faces on the Bud Light cans. And they encourage the kids in the stadium. By the way, I don't know how you can really do that because a lot of these kids are underage, but whatever. So they encourage the kids in the stadium to scan the QR code for the chance of winning a flight, a private flight over the football stadium, courtesy of Bud Light. So this is called Easy to Sunday, Easy to Enjoy Bud Light. And that is their new hope. I mean, they they have one like every week and it's not making a difference because they offended their drinkers in a really massive way. And let's just face it, like that's an easy replacement. You can go to Coors Light, you can go to Mick Ultra, oh, forgive me, that would be another, by the way, that is an Anheuser, AB InBev company, but Coors Light, of course, is owned by Molson Coors, which has seen appreciation in their stock price, or you can go to many, many others. I mean, the the one that keeps getting the, the you know, the prize is, is Modelo. That's now the number one beer in America. Used to be Bud Light. Hmm. Wow. Flame is feeding. <laughs> Fleeting, as they say. Hey everyone, Trish Regan here. If you enjoyed that clip, please do me the favor of subscribing to the channel. Just hit that little subscribe button right over there. Did I do that right? Uh, Not quite, but you know where it is. Subscribe to the channel, hit the bell so that you get the alerts, and I'll see you back on the show.